the Ohio Valley Converse would get a night to remember as the Gallia Academy Blue Devils would travel to Proctorville to take on the Fairland Dragons. The stakes were high for this game as the Blue Devils looked to maintain their undefeated season streak while the Dragons tried to make both teams 2-1 in the conference by the end of the night. To start off the first quarter, both teams would have to punt on their first possessions, but for Fairland's second offensive possession, they would get the first score of the game with a 48-yard run from Quits and Creams, but would end up missing the extra point. The second quarter would become a different story as both offenses began to heat up. With the first play of the second quarter, Hunter Sham would run for 72 yards to give the Blue Devils the lead. But the Dragons wouldn't back down so easily. Within the next five minutes of gameplay, Fairland would put up 15 points on the board. The first score would be a 10-yard pass to Bryson Hunt from Peyton Jackson, and then Christian Collins would find himself in the end zone after running 84 yards. The 15 points from Fairland were accomplished through the two interceptions that the Blue Devils committed during the second quarter. Turnovers would become a major factor for both teams as Galley Academy would have three interceptions and the Dragons would have two fumbles. Fairland would head into the second half with a 21-7 lead, but this lead would not last long. With a 40-yard run into the end zone from Kenyon Franklin and the pick six from Hunter Shamblin, the Blue Devils would be within striking distance of getting the lead. But for this game, when one team struck, the other would strike back. For the second half, Fairland would resort to their pass plays as they would get easy looks in the middle of the field to find the open receiver. One of these plays would become a touchdown for the Dragons as Christian Collins would find the open spot and score with ease. With only 4 minutes and 8 seconds left in the fourth quarter, Fairland would have a 34-27 lead over the Blue Devils. But with Keegan Smith's 83-yard sprint down the sideline, there was no looking back for the Dragons as they would win this game 40-35. With the win for the Dragons and the loss for the Blue Devils, there is now a four-way tie for the second place spot in the OBC between Fairland, Galley Academy, South Point, and Portsmouth, with Ironton still holding on to the first place spot heading into Week 7.